All right, we break up the reacts with a with a, a crappy aquariums. Makes sense to me. Let's do it. Let us look at top from this week. This has probably been a bit more than a week since I've looked. Okay, this is a restaurant fish tank. My God, is that what is going on? Is that like one of those long fin koi? But he has the ridiculously fin rot. I don't think that is a crazy messed up fish. Can't say the F word because it's the first 30 seconds of the video. Oh, you guys forgot to say hi to YouTube. I kind of forgot to. Hi, YouTube. That is a very messed up set of fins on a koi. So it's a, like a long fin koi, but with crazy levels of fin rot. That's crazy. I'll never understand why pet stores do this. Knife fish in this tank. My God. I felt I even felt bad when I like temporarily. Here, let me find the picture. I caught a, a wild knife fish in Malaysia and I had to put it in my photo tank and my photo tank was not big enough for this knife fish. So I just fit him in there real quick, but I felt bad. He just barely was not big enough for this tank. So I felt bad my knife fish. I had to like put him aside. He's a, he's a little bit bent in there and then release him real quick from this like swampy area in Malaysia, which is kind of cool. But yeah, I felt bad about that. Imagine his permanent home being this. This is a bit ridiculous. Trying to tell my friend this aquarium is bad. Okay, I'm sorry. Is that a channel catfish, two tiger barbs, and lamales? Or are those goldfish with weird coloration? What the hell is going on in this? This is the most random assortment of things I think I've ever seen. I don't even know what these are, but like typical tropical fish. Then we've got Southeast Asian barb type fish. And then just uh, this dude just caught a caught a channel cat out in the wild. Two cha Oh, there's a second channel cat. I didn't even notice two channel cats, two tiger barbs, two mollies. Ah, uh, yes. Perfectly balanced as all uh, all fish tanks should be. You can win a goldfish by throwing a ping pong ball in a fish bowl with a live fish in it. I saw kids taking goldfish in bags into the bouncy houses. Oh my god, each one of the bowls has a goldfish in it? That's absurd. I can't believe this is still happening. I thought we would have moved past this. Like, I know when I was a kid, okay, like, people didn't know anything and we had the goldfish at the carnivals and everything like that. I thought we would have moved past this at this point. Local pet store posted this, they seem proud. Hello neighbors, you never know who will swim into Pet Supplies Plus in Marble Falls. Meet Lemon, our first beta visitor. Lemon dropped in just in time because we're currently offering 50% off select fish tanks. I hope this is more than 50% off. How are you a pet store trying this hard on advertising but putting a beta fish in a jar, bro? This is crazy. If you put even like a little bit of the effort that you put into what terrible joke? Where do fish go on vacation? Finland? Jesus. They should be boycotted just for that. Um, oh, there's two in them. A gallon betta fish tank is a great option for those who want to keep a small, easily manageable aquarium. This size tank is perfect for housing one or two bettas and can easily be placed on a countertop or desk. Plus, a gallon fish tank doesn't require much in the way of filtration or maintenance, making it an ideal choice for beginner fish keepers. It is absurdly impressive that they can live in that for any period of time. I mean, that is genuinely impressive. What is this? Someone asking for help on the worms on their tank? Oh, that just happens if you overfeed a bit. That's fine. Don't worry about it. Planaria. New at our vet. That is an especially messed up shape. of. What is the bowl melting? What is this? What is this design? I'm confused. Is the bowl melting? <laughs> it's like they they were like, no, this this gallon uh, bowl is too big, actually, for my betta fish. I think I need to make it a bit smaller and artsy by messing with the bottom. Cool design, but too small, isn't it? Jesus. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I guess the design is a little bit cool. At least they have a bubbler with their 40 comet goldfish in this tiny horizontal tank. And a tank like this would be so cool for so many things. Like this is like a crayfish, a small crayfish tank would be dope. 
I can't tell how big it actually is, but like it's a small crayfish tank with a little bit of flow to it. I gotta show you. Next time I do a, I have a friend who has like a native fishes tank and a non-native fishes tank and he'll like catch stuff and put it in there. So he's put like blunt nose minnows and weather loach and stuff in there. And it's like a stream tank where it has like a flow to it and looks like a natural New Jersey stream. I'm trying to get him to submit to uh, future fish tank competitions. He just has missed the first two, but I want him to submit because this is really cool. Basically this, but done right. Just in case the half gallon Walmart beta tanks are not enough. A less than half, 0.26 gallons, quarter gallons. We're just getting smaller. Next up, we're gonna be eighth of eighth of a gallon fish tanks. No words. It is advertised as a fish tank. What? What? If a guppy can barely fit in it, that is problematic. One pint. We somehow got smaller. I I didn't think we could get smaller than the fourth of a tank, but. This is um, a new level of impressive. Yep. Typical crappy aquarium. Hey, only three bucks, though. Honestly, the fish probably worth that. Found on Kijiji. I don't know what that is, but holy shit. This, these are reef fish. Every one of these is reef fish. And they're in an open, somehow cloudy tank, which I'm not even sure has any salt in it, with absolutely nothing. The only structure with which they have to in, <laughs> it, it, interact with is this. What did they do? Just pick out a random assortment? Two clownfish? Butterfly fish? Like, what is this? This is absurd. I a store I found this from actually refuses to sell fish for anything smaller than 10 gallons. Well, how big is the tank? I can't even tell. This looks like a messed up tank. What is this? Does it even say how many gallons it is? I have no idea how many gallons this is, but what the hell is this shape? It looks small, but I can't really tell. 5.5 liters? Oh, I don't know. Liters to... Liters to... Gallons. Someone can, can uh, convert that. I don't even know. Are liters bigger than gallons or smaller than gallons? I only use freedom units here in my free country. Oh, it's 10,000 gallons? Yeah, I believe you, totally. My friend's tank. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Okay. That's a random assortment of things. It's 1.4 gallons. Oh, jeez. Bumble match? He matched with someone on Bumble who had this in their profile? Holy crap. <laughs> That's an actual bowl with a shitload of Comet Goldfish in it. That's not like, oh, a fish bowl. That's an actual bowl. Classic. Got like 50 arowanas in this tiny tank. Oh my god. Found these two at the local supermarket. This is a Tupperware. This certainly was not intended to fish bowl. Usually when we see fish in bowls, they're like small. They're like baby comet goldfish because they don't last that long. These are like not small. These are like adult goldfish. Maybe not adult. They're not that big, but they're decent sized goldfish. My nine year old cousin's betta tank. Wow. Why does it look so small? The betta fish, I mean. Wow, very nice. Good job. Absolute monstrosity I saw on the internet. Nice. Classic. You know, if you have two male bettas, they'll kill each other. But if you put a nice little divider in the middle of your 0.5 gallon tank, then they'll just die. <laughs> and you don't have to worry about them killing each other. My buddy's saltwater aquarium. I'm sorry, is that a dead fish just laying there? I'm sorry. What's going on with this tank? The aquarium itself doesn't look that bad, but why is there just a dead fish? Bro's chilling? Oh yeah, my bad for assuming his aliveness. Homie's just chilling on the bottom, I guess. So I have a river tank. It's all native species to my area. I was wondering what are some good aquarium fish to add? I consider catching a few more fish like a green sunfish or pumpkin seed to add some color to the tank this is a monstrosity what is this it's so small and there's a giant catfish is that a mosquito fish bro that catfish is gonna eat your mosquito fish why why is this catfish in there this catfish already ate one of your decor look at its stomach yeah fuck it man add a add a buffalo or something a common carp what state is ms is ms mississippi or missouri i think mo is missouri right 
So this is Mississippi. Yeah, I'm sure you could find something like a carp to put in there. Now, while looking at coffee tables on Amazon. It is a cute coffee table. I think we had this coffee table in my house as a kid. It looks very familiar. One time I tried to lay on the bottom, and like lay out, and this broke. This bottom slab is not as stable as it looks, so I just fell to the floor. I think I cried. This is lovely. What is this? Saw this on Conan, an underwear fish tank. <laughs> what is... I, that's just a horrifying concept. What? Why and what? And I'm gonna... You know, I think I'm good. I think... <laughs> I thought I got Flash too, but... No, it's safe for work, somehow. Don't put this in the thumbnail, Ghost Boy. I know it's very tempting to put this in the thumbnail, but we will get demonetized. Actually, you know what? Maybe you can put this in the thumbnail. I don't know. You you decide, Ghost Boy. I'm not going to be responsible for whether this gets flagged on YouTube or not. All right, that's enough crappy aquariums for the day. Whoa.